Um, the next things that um, we need to talk about in order to um, deal with the budget is if there are children involved in the case, um, one, of the parent, one of the parents is going to be granted, um, likely granted, a tax dependency exemption for the children. There are many different ways this can be done. It can be um, if there's one child, the parents can alternate that tax dependency exemption, or if there are two children, both parents can take one tax dependency exemption. Um, it's something that needs to ta be taken into consideration when preparing a budget because um, there may be limitations on taking a tax dependency exemption. It may be oftentimes um, an obligor for child support purposes only gets to take the tax dependency exemption in the event that they are um, substantially current on child support. And so, um, if that's the case, they may be expecting to be able to take that tax dependency exemption, but if they're not substantially current on the child support, they can't. And the other parent could um, get to take that. Um, there could also be situations where there might be years that you're not going to receive the exemption, and in that case, um, you would need to budget for that. 